So apparently there might be a recession, depending on who you ask. However, there are certain updates to your home that will provide you with the most ROI, regardless if we're in a recession or not. So I'm gonna go over some recommendations to see if they could be of value to you. So while remodeling a kitchen, adding a bedroom, or perhaps adding a bathroom are usually at the top of the list of what people consider a great investment into a home with the highest ROI, there are certain upgrades that produce great ROIs on a budget. So Remodeling Magazine's 2022 cost versus value report lists the projects with the best return on investment has garage door replacement on the top of the list with the average national cost of just over $4,000. Homeowners can reap a 93% ROI. A new steel entry door at around 2,200 can result in a 64% ROI. But what updates can be done on a budget? Here's a list. Repaint walls in white to show the buyers a blank canvas. Remove any mirrors on the walls that seem dated along with any fixtures. Paint dark kitchen cabinets white or a lighter color, remove all carpeting and refinish floors, update doorknobs and kitchen cabinet pools, replace bathroom fixtures, fix or update all lighting, remove outdated window treatments and wash all windows, regrout bathrooms and update old vanities. So that's a list that I have personally seen as a great list of things that you can do to your home that will provide the most ROI. I'll give you the perfect example. A lot of homes, especially here in Northeast Florida, were track builders and they'll use construction grade like light bulbs and the mirrors and these lighting fixtures, the faucets. It's always my best advice to sellers to upgrade those things because they're usually pretty cost effective. Get a great mirror with some really nice lighting and a great kind of newer faucet, dress things up a little bit. Those changes will make a huge impact on how a space feels. Also just the smell of paint, believe it or not, has like this new smell for people. That's the sense they get, like, mm, it's smell of paint, like something's new. That is actually appealing to people. The smell of cinnamon along with uh, chocolate chip cookies. They, they've done some type of research on that. So those, those are little things as far as a smell in your home. Another thing to consider is, you know, obviously, if you're thinking of selling or if you're going to stay in the home long term. And this is the advice I usually give somebody. You want to make sure to upgrade based off the competition unless you're willing to compensate on price. So that's very important. Other factors include, you know, other things that the property has in regards to features that might compensate for an outdated kitchen or something like that. But it's case by case. Now, if you plan on living in the home long term, you know, they're going to carry you out of this house do what you want doesn't matter <laughs> right now if you plan on selling it though don't do anything too crazy but you know if you plan on selling it in less than 10 years be careful but if you plan on retiring in the home and just whatever do whatever makes you happy but those are upgrades that i feel are inexpensive and will provide you with the most roi exterior landscaping is another one cleaning up the exterior of the home with some nice shrubbery and some plants, some perennials, painting the fence, pressure washing. Those things add a huge ROI to a home. And especially with the times that we're in right now, they're cost effective. And it's always important to love where you live and appreciate your surroundings. And if there's not a lot of money coming out of pocket to accomplish those goals, why not? If you have any specific questions about what you should probably do to your home, especially in these times, whether you're thinking of selling or you're thinking of redoing the home to make it feel fresh, we'll be more than happy to talk to you, walk you through a few things that we see in the market and hopefully be of value. As usual, it's a pleasure. Roberto Perez, Keller Williams Realty. Take care. Thank you for watching the video. If you want to see more videos like this, please subscribe and smash the like button so that we know that you like what we're doing so we'll do more of it.